Below 404 Boxing. All right, man, let me speak on something right quick. Okay, you know, I try to put out a lot of content. You know what I'm saying? I, I bring up things, bring up points that I've heard, read, stuff I try to remember. My memory ain't the damn best, so, <laughs> but I try to I try to bring up points that I remember about certain things um, that I've learned about boxing over the years. I've been following boxing a long time. But I will say this. Sometimes when I'm making a video off the fly, I don't have the content in front of me. Um, I'm trying to spitball it, so to speak. And I misspeak sometimes. You know, sometimes I may say somebody's record's wrong. I may say the name wrong. I may say an opponent wrong. I may reference the wrong fight, whatever it is. But what I will say about that is anytime that I make those type of mistakes, it's in earnest. I'm not trying to mislead anyone. And I appreciate when those of you who support me on a consistent basis come in or even the ones who don't support consistently, just the ones who come in and support because support is support. And I appreciate it all. So when you come in, like, like take for instance, L Dub, Lawrence Williams, you know, like, there have been several times that I've, you know, talked about a subject. I couldn't remember the name or something. He came in the comment section, told me who it was after the fact or correcting me later, whatever the case might be, or I might've misspoke on a ranking or something. And he corrected me. Every single time, it's always love and appreciation from my vantage point, from, from my standpoint, to say, hey, man, I appreciate that because I'm trying to put the information out there correctly. And as a supporter of other channels and a fan of some of these channels, when I when I speak to someone in the comment section about something they misspoke on, if I'm saying, hey, man, it, uh, this is what it is, I always say it in a respectful manner. I never try to attack someone like, hey, man, you put out misinformation because I don't know what someone's intentions are. But what I will say is when I do so and then it's not well received and it's like, oh, you need to do this then because I'm just saying what I heard and that shit rolls me the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not that type of guy. I'm not trying to shine on nobody. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't trying to come on, come on nobody's channel and embarrass them. Just like I don't take it as an insult or embarrassment when somebody does it to me. Now, if somebody comes and just says, hey, man, you know damn well that ain't true. You just putting that shit out there because you're trying to make somebody look good or trying to protect the fight or whatever. That's a different story. But the case in which I'm talking about, it, it's very, very simple where somebody repeated something. They're, they're saying that the fighter said it. I'm saying, and I basically just said, no, that isn't true. I didn't, and in the video, he didn't say the fighter said it. He said it as a fact. And I just said, no, nah, that ain't the case. Yada, yada, yada. Which, well, what I'm stating, I know it, I know to be true. But I wasn't saying it to show the guy up. You know what I'm saying? It's like I said, it's all love and support. But it's like, I, would, I wouldn't want to put something out and just say somebody like Trey X, L Dub, Marlo, whoever that comes to my channel consistently. Or, or Wu 36 Daddy or Cypher Supreme, whoever. Um, and and y'all forgive me if y'all didn't want me calling your names out, but you know what I'm saying? I'm, using, I'm saying it for a point, not no no disrespect intended. But if, if y'all heard me say something totally wrong, I would rather you correct me, even in the comment section, if you can't hit me behind the scenes. Tell me in the comment section so that going forward, I'm not continuously saying that same statement misrepresent something whether whether intentional or not i'd rather somebody correct me so that going forward i can put out the right information so i'm saying that i'm making this video to say this you know who to anybody who watches my videos that i also support if i come to your channel and i and i say something as a rebuttal of something you said it's not intended as a form of disrespect and if you take it that way then I would appreciate it if you just let me know without trying to come at me as if you're trying to attack me. Because a lot of times I only know one way to respond when I feel attacked. But th in this particular case, this is my response. And this is me saying that in the future, if anything like this happens again, handle me the right way so I can address you the right way. I don't want to be talking to another grown man 
and that grown man tell me to go talk to another grown man about something he said. I don't deal that way. So, like I said, when I say something wrong, I misstate something, I have no problem with somebody saying, hey, D-Lo, that ain't, that ain't right. I don't think that's right. And then if, it, if, if you're wrong, then I'm going to come back and say, no, nah, man, I looked it up. This is what it is. If you're right, I'm going to say, man, I appreciate it. It is what it is. But I'm not gonna come, I'm not gonna come back and tell you, well man, I heard from such and such, you go ask them about it. Now nah, I ain't doing that. And neither am I going to, you know what I'm saying, come at you with venom because you corrected me. I feel like if you corrected me in my video and you came to me the right way, you're trying to help me out. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't looking crazy, continuously repeat something that ain't true. And I'm gonna leave it at that. Went on longer than I wanted to anyway. That's all I got to say on the subject. D-Lo 404 Boxing. Like, share, comment, subscribe. I'm out. Peace.